Permanent rivers are now seasonal. Forests have been destroyed to a level where there are now assaults. And above all, the diminishing rain pattern is a worry to all of us. So when the judiciary comes together to think green, to think environment, it is very encouraging to many of us. I believe, Chief Justice, you invited me here to give you an assurance that any legislative proposals that comes to Parliament on many matters, but particularly on environment, will be given top priority. Your Excellency, we need a serious review of environmental-related legislation because most of it predates our independence when we used to tap offenders on the wrist and tell them to go away. People armed with power saws mowing down forests with impunity get away with it. People who release pollutants into our fresh water sources like rivers get away with impunity. We urge you, the law lords, to ensure that you also exert a bit of influence on the executive. Don't sit there and wait for the laws to be brought to you to interpret and administer. Also make proposals to the executive that this law, the punishment is too lenient, the enforcement is difficult, make it easier so that we can be able to protect our environment.